Greetings IB artists and welcome teachers and parents as well. So today I really want to know if you have any questions for me. So today I thought I'd give you a break from the cats and also I wanted to say that this week I don't have any content for the importance of being RT series. The artists, whomever says yes to the project, I like to give them a lot of time so that they're happy that they are creating content for you guys. I'm very, very grateful to all those who have said yes and really given so generously of their time. Today I don't have any content for that series, but I thought it would be a good opportunity for me to just say hello and that I'm still around and to really see if you guys have any questions for me. Of course, I do have a lot of questions coming in via email and that's great and I take a lot of time over my answers. I try and do as much research as possible, but of course I am limited. So today I thought it would be great if you guys could send me questions that you think are not only relevant to you but relevant to other people so in a way you're helping people and you're also giving me ideas for you know what you guys need to focus on. Um, I also want to quickly just outline some of the ideas that I have for future videos. So one of the ideas that I have is that I answer some of the frequently asked questions for the extended essay. Th that's kind of the, the topic that most people write to me about. They also write to me about the comparative study and the process portfolio, obviously, but the most frequent questions are the, on the extended essay. I will try and highlight some of the recurring questions, themes, issues in one of my future videos. So you are welcome, especially more general questions would be really, really great if you could leave the questions in the comments below. That way I have more relevant ideas and more relevant content that would obviously directly interest you and everybody that is on this course. Another video that I think I would like to get into, I would really like to have a look at people's sketchbooks because I think sketchbooks are really, really important. And I think I've kind of told you what not to do, but I would like to focus more on what to actually do as well. I think that would be really, really good. Another idea that I have is to create a kind of a booklet, perhaps an ebook, summarizing a lot of the points that I make in my videos, especially regarding the kind of general stuff about criteria, general tips for successfully navigating this course. So I would love to hear about what you think. I know that some of my videos are a little bit long. And that's because I really try and cram in as much content as I can. So this is why I thought it's probably a good idea to have that in some kind of written form. So like I said, I'm thinking about putting together some kind of book, like a handbook possibly. And I know that you get one from the IBO and that's great. You should be studying that. But I think that the tips and the things that I stress is from the point of view of an experienced teacher and what I've come across. So again, I would really like to know what you guys think and what you think should go into that ebook. You know, any kind of special or specific areas that you want me to cover, I would love to do that. So this is possibly something that I can do. It would be a, a good little project uh, to kind of just put all the summarized info into a booklet. And I would really like to get some kind of a conversation going between students, between teachers, between parents as well. So this is kind of where my intention was at the beginning of this channel. 
and so if you have any ideas i am more than happy to kind of have a look at that and consider it and see if it serves the channel well and if it's useful for the general ib art audience so the last thing i want to say thank you so much guys for supporting this channel i'm so grateful to the people who have subscribed i'm so grateful for you know all the likes and and please share this content it would be great if we could make this channel grow together and become this really nice community that supports each other which includes of course the students themselves who are my primary focus but also teachers and of course also parents because it is quite it can be a mysterious kind of course where parents are, feel a little bit ambivalent about what is actually going on. I'll be very happy for questions from you. Uh, and like I said, again, you know, especially generic questions that are relevant to a lot of people. Okay, so it's getting dark in here. I, I hope you guys are enjoying the videos, especially the importance of being RT series. I think those are really quite important videos. I wish I had that guidance when I was a student in high school. Uh, so I hope this is helping you guys out. Again, please, please, please get in touch. Leave a comment below. Let me know what you would most like to see on this channel, what you would like me to discuss and, and clarify and support in any way that you uh, think is, is useful. So this is Miss A. Thank you so much for watching this little video. I would love to hear from you. Enjoy your festive season. Get that curatorial rationale done if you're in IB2. My next video is the curatorial rationale part two. That should be out in a timely manner for you to kind of look at before you go back to school. All the best. This is Miss A.